Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. Hey, hey, hey. Hey everybody, it's Alma. Quick grocery haul today. And let me tell you, it is Yellow Sticker City, which means I got some discounts. All right, so guys, this is heavy protein based. No, I have not started carnivore. No, I have not really started zero carb with the family illness that has hit. Um, my time is spread a little thin, so um, that will happen. I've just kind of got to get life under control. So this is sort of lazy keto, sort of questionable keto. Um, in the sense that I got salad and the salad does have some carrots in it. So that is somewhat questionable guys, but I'm not worried about it right now. And I'll explain in a video coming up. All right, so here we go guys. Um, I picked up this lovely pork butt roast. Look at that. Check it out, got it on sale, $9.37, $2.80 off. I got two packages of my chicken thighs. David loves and when I say loves, I mean loves, my arroz con pollo. Then I have two more of my pork jowls. Guys, this stuff is amazing. If you haven't purchased it yet, check out your local Walmart. I heard they're at Kroger's. Thank you very much. I believe Sarah shared that with me. Um, and the price again, this one is $3.44 pound. And these pork jowls, guys, check out the video up right hand corner. Amazing. So the same pork jowl bacon comes already cut so it's a little more expensive that's 344 a pound this is 372 a pound but let me tell you guys this stuff is so good it's actually worth it and you guys know that i'm fairly cheap so if i say it's worth it it truly is worth it then i found a rotisserie chicken this rotisserie chicken will most likely be eaten with my salads um i am just craving a salad guys and i think you sometimes as long as it's fairly keto feed that craving guys your body may be needing something all right i am pretty much done with my liver kick um I love liver don't get me wrong but I am not craving it like I was on a daily basis so obviously my body was needing something whether it be iron uh, I don't know but if you are doing carnivore definitely include some organ meat beef heart uh, beef heart is delicious guys if you can find it in your store um, chicken hearts gizzards liver kidney all that stuff guys although i've never tried kidney if you have tried kidney beef kidney let me know all right so i also purchased this check it out this is chuck eye guys chuck eye is one rib off from the ribeye so you can see how nicely marbled it is got this on sale savings of 97 cents hey it's only 97 cents but when you get two of them like two bucks virtually all right picked up some aged swiss and guys did you check out the video that i posted for the reuben roll-ups that's why i got some more swiss i didn't go to the deli guys i was in a hurry i got to get over to help my family and um so i wanted to at least get my grocery shopping because today is the last day for 88 cents eggs at randall's so i had to go pick up eight of those some will go uh, with me when i visit my family member and some will stay here picked up three avocados one red onion and that wraps it up guys I don't have a lot of veggies as you can see um, so tomorrow as I do meal prep I will probably also have picked up a few veggies uh, to prepare my meal prep with hey everybody it's Alma I told you guys part two of my grocery haul would be coming and here it is all this is from Walmart guys all right so I told you guys that I needed some veggies here we go here they are along with some additional protein now I want to make some tostadas and I thought you know what instead of just your standard lettuce let's check out how the angel hair coleslaw will go this package is pre-shredded for you at $1.77 not a bad buy guys also picked up this wonderful salad mix this has a lot of cabbage in it let's, all the ingredients the only thing that's really questionable in here guys is of course the carrots you can pick it out or go ahead and just run with it it's a very um, minuscule amount so hopefully it doesn't raise our blood sugars I'm not sure if it would be in I don't know in your serving you might have three little slivers so I, I just can't be that OCD right now about things while I am helping my sister get my mom back into health and she is on antibiotics for the infection and oh my gosh she's doing so much better so she's never been hospitalized or anything like that guys it's just that you know when your parents get older it's a little more scary 
Uh, for those of you that are new to my channel, I shared a couple days ago that my videos are a bit far and few between because I had a, a relative that got sick and it happens to be my mom. So um, that's why I have been <laughs> like a mad woman making sure I'm getting in my exercise, trying to take care of my family and of course my beloved mommy. So there we go, guys. All right, so also some mozzarella cheese, guys. I, I would have loved to go into the deli, but again, this is kind of surviving keto right now, truly, because uh, she is priority right now. And then I picked up some more. This is the um, actual slices. I told you guys, yum, habanero jack. If this is habanero, if this is jalapeno, if this is spicy, guys, I'm on it. So let's check it out here. Um, it does have salt enzyme. It's not terrible, guys, but it doesn't. You'll, but the good thing is, you notice there is no what? There's no starches. So there you go. Then I got some cheese, uh, some Swiss cheese. Why? Because I'm telling you guys, if you haven't checked out my deli melts, check it out. Makes life amazingly easy for a quick lunch guys add a little more extra fat dip it in mayo make yourself some of my wonderful garlic aioli check in the upper right hand corner i'll leave a link to that dip your lovely uh, deli melt into some of that garlic aioli and sister son it's good all right i also got some jalapenos i'm gonna make us some arroz con pollo that's something easy that if i need to stay late um, at my, with my mom then um, definitely the arroz con pollo is something great for my husband to warm up so there's some cilantro to go with it my onions again I showed you the jalapenos these are for Matthew he actually likes the wingettes this was on sale I got this I'm thinking beggars can't be choosers right <laughs> so there we go also pork cracklins Matthew is doing kind of low carb right now he's not really following keto but he's pretty much doing low carb so I got these for him to snack on because he does like his snacks and then guys I'm telling you the pork jowls so if you're new to my channel welcome 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 and uh, what i have been buying is the smithfield uh pork jowl bacon it is divine guys this here is a chunk of it so you have to cut it up yourself um, but the reason i do like that is because i can make some nice thick cuts or i can cut this up into squares and put it in my uh, breakfast casserole on the weekends which was delicious by the way and um, then lastly guys they also sell this already cut and the fat content on this is amazing guys let me look at this all right so it shows over here it is 350 calories per serving 330 from fat and this here is about a serving size is about two ounces zero grams of carbs i'm sure there's some sugar listed in there guys but again this is delicious i am just not going to mind it right now most bacons have it if you can find the perfect butchered kind that has no nothing in it go for it guys um, this again is let's see where's the protein look at that four grams of protein in comparison to how much 36 grams of fat. If you were having a hard time getting your fat in, guys, check this out. Amazing. Even if you didn't do a full serving of two ounces and you stuck to one ounce, amazing. 150 cal well, 180 calories, maybe somewhere around there. And oh my gosh, over 15 grams of carbs. I'm sorry, over 15 grams of fat. And you'll have what? Uh, two grams of protein excellent source of getting in your fat if you need it all right and look at it you can just tell look at that that has got some heavy fat content to it and the taste there's only one word we have both used it they've talked about this on my channel decadent decadent guys oh my gosh delicious truly try it try it try it again i get these at walmart they're not in the bacon section you know how typically there's that center aisle that is refrigerated and it, you just kind of it, it, and it's just deep wells or, or refrigerator wells. I don't know what they're called. If you know what it's called, type it in there. I'm clueless right now. I, my brain is not functioning. But if you um, know it, let me know. But that's where they are. So we're, we're, where you might find the turkey legs and some of the, um, the pork bones and all those meat, meaty soup bones, that's where you're going to find these. Or just ask an attendant. You're looking for the pork jowl bacon and or this is also the same name it's just not sliced all right so there you go and let's talk a little bit about our pork rinds linda checked out my video for microwave pork rinds i have them right here guys all right here they are and she was talking about the fact that they're kind of expensive and keep in mind this is a what two and a half pound bag 
uh, makes 32 cups, 16 ounces. All right, 16 ounces. And she said, you know, for 26 bucks, it's kind of expensive. And she is absolutely right. But let me tell you my argument against that. All right, love you, Linda. <laughs> so I'm not arguing against you. I am just kind of enlightening um, others to what's going on here with the pork rinds. All right, let's take a look at this package here, guys. So you have a you have a package that is 6.25 ounces of cooked pork rinds. This was $2.78, somewhere around there. All right, and then you look at it and it says there's about 13 uh, servings per container, which is a half an ounce. Traditionally, it's about nine pieces, if you look at it, about nine pieces, all right? That nine pieces is uh, 13 servings in here. All right, 13 servings. So if you look at this for $26 and it's nine pieces, guys, I cannot even tell you how many servings you're gonna get out of this. All right, if you haven't seen my video on this, guys, check in the upper right-hand corner. I'll leave you a link. But this is going to give you for $26. I bet you when I'm finished with it, I need to, you know what I need to do? I need to put like little hash marks because we've already done like six servings of this. And uh, if I leave little hash marks, we can count out how many servings I got out of the entire bag, which might kind of be an, uh, might be interesting to see what the value actually is. Uh, yeah, guys, uh, it, it, taste comparison from this to this, there's no comparison. Um, if they could make this with a little bit of this here extra fat attached to it, it would be beyond remarkable. Seriously, it would be divine. So. <laughs> I'm already in love with these though. But guys, that wraps it up. So I'm gonna stay tuned for my meal prep. And I'm gonna head out for a little bit. Oh, let me give you some stats. All right, so today is um, the Thursday, the 12th, and we have 17,076 steps. And that was about, I don't know, just under seven miles. So there we go, guys. Have a blessed day. See you very soon. Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification button so that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye-bye. Choice Wednesday, it's Onito. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah. Like <laughs> tea.